Hey there, I wanted to show you this super simple demo of LangChain and basically giving access to my terminal. So in this example, it's just 15 lines of code or less than 15 lines of code. And we're using LangChain, giving it access to the terminal and basically telling it to interact with the computer and do stuff using natural language. So this is the command we're gonna run. It says you have access to the terminal through the bash variable, open the browser, Go to YouTube and search for Lex Friedman. Then write the text contents from the page into a file called page.txt. So you can see this is our structure. We're going to get another file at the end of this. So let's just run this main.py file in the terminal and see what happens. So we can do that with Python main.py. And it's working. Okay, it opened the browser to Lex Friedman. And then it looks like it's done. So we can see what it did. It used the Python REPL to, op to open the web browser, go to YouTube for Alex Friedman, search for Alex Friedman. Then it imported requests. It got the contents of the page and it wrote it to a file called page.txt. Page and then it came to a conclusion that the work was done. And so if we go to VS Code now, we can see that there is a file called page.txt and this has all the contents of the Lex Friedman page. And you can make sure that that's true by just typing in Lex Friedman. So this is just a super simple demo, but you can see there's a lot of potential applications you can build just by telling it stuff to do and giving it access to your computer. But yeah, hopefully that was helpful.